But you, especially working in a nuclear power field, we were a little bit different than a lot of the military. I'd say special forces probably out there, but what they're training you to do is how to think, right? They're, they're really teaching you how to think. The school does a terrible job of this. You know, and anybody who's gone through any sort of education, you know, K through 12, they don't teach you how to think. They teach you how to memorize and regurgitate, right? And the, the idea would be you need to le learn how to think because not everything is written in a book and things aren't going to go well every single time. And, oh my gosh, if this pump fails when you're at total operating capacity, operating power, 100% power, and that pump is critical to the operation of the plant and this thing breaks, how do you fix it? How do you get back up and running? How do you prevent from dying if it does leak and starts creating a flood or steam line rupture, things like that? And so you train over and over and over again. All right, and what this does is it builds your ability to think on the fly and get think and figure out solutions to problems, which is a great tool for any, any employer to have any business to have. You know, I always say that the your value in the world is relation to the, the size of the problems you can solve.